Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. <laughs> this is our new housewife. Who apparently makes pancakes with bananas and... One housewife, very available if you want to call the link below. Really? <laughs> Okay, well the housewife doesn't do school drop-off. <laughs> he slash she finishes there. I just wanted to show you this because it's really bad actually. I, I've i been really thirsty, but I'm thinking this is obviously the reason. Sam Pellegrino uh, make these amazing like flavored sparkling drinks, if that makes sense. Um, they're their flavors. Um, so limonata, it's kind of like, to be honest, it's limoncello without the alcohol, <laughs> but it's so refreshing. There's a, um, is it giannata, which is like, I think it's like the grapefruit. I'm not quite sure. And then there's the, like, it's like a tangerine. Oh my God, guys. These are, these are my gorgeous provincial glasses just makes it better you know why not wake up nice and early and drink your <laughs> lemonata in your provincial glass how bougie mm. so refreshing i can't stop drinking them i asked will to bring like a box home but then the next second i was like actually don't <laughs> they're probably loaded with sugar knowing me and my luck Oh, my forking. Bro, <laughs> come on, have it. Have it. Okay. Have it, have it. Is there more? Good job. My PO box, both of my little helpers. Ow. Oh, there's more, mate. Hey, so, hold this. See, hold this. this. Us getting your mail, mouth. guys. Oh, God. <clears throat> push, push. Oh. It's like you push me. Come on, use all your strength. <laughs> 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 YouTube, bro. I can't remember if I link this below, but this is my Hydro Flask from Fashion File. I need to get this on my merch. I scratch and do it. I need to get Jerusha Couture Hydro Flask on my merch. I'm not sure if the company I'm with does it, but anyway, I lost the lid to it and I wanted like a gym lid. <laughs> Like an easy access lid. Will hates straws. Um, in the gym, he just wants to be able to pour the water into his mouth. So I got him one of these. And I had lost the lid to this. So I got this off Amazon, of course. So that worked really nicely. And it fits and it's perfect. We're going to the gym. It's on, okay? So we're going to do some of this. And this is um, the veggie brand from, um, veggie blend, sorry, from Nudie. Um, if you watched my last vlog, Will and I were just saying these are just straight apple juice, basically. But this guy has beetroot, carrot, ginger, um, pear and orange. So we'll give it a go. That's good. That's a bit better than the other one that we were drinking in the car. He's like, this is apple juice. He's like, no, it's got heaps of veggies. I drink, I'm like, this is apple juice. You can taste the carrot and the ginger. I think the thing is they've got to make these mainstream. They've got to be able to sell these in supermarkets, you know, so whatever. Whatever. Might as well just make your own. Plus we have a juicer. Oh, we have like one of the big juicers. He even has a juicer juicer that like carrots go through. Are you one of those families that just have so many <laughs> kitchen appliances? You basically hoard them. We do use a lot of them, to be fair, we do. Like the kids love jaffle sandwiches, you know, cheese and tomato jaffles. So there's a jaffle maker and a flat sandwich maker. Luckily enough, we can say because of the restaurant. So it's kind of like a, you know, default, but either way, 
Do you collect kitchen appliances? Let me know. On the pieces, my broken pieces, I'm riding all the way to a different life. On the way, I drift away, cause I'm hungry for a taste of another land. Another land. Another land. You know, he still calls. He still calls breakfast dinner. I can't correct him. So cute. This little sod. Are you sitting on my very expensive bed? I've got bad news. I need a new G7X. I need a new G7X. Can I credit card? Also known as a camera. Yes. I need a man photo stand. Can we no, go shopping? can't take anything from me. No money, no Please. cash. Please? Here, no cash. Please? Here, no cash. <laughs> no cash. Is that what they say? Robert, no cash. What's that from? <laughs> Chopper. Chopper? That's it. I don't have Okay, we're going to get Willie to try. No, we're this not. veggie juice that I have with you guys. Yeah. Well, because I said the other one had veggies in it, and you're like, it's apple juice. And I'm like, it said veggies. Oh, it's apple juice. <laughs> so I tried this guy, immune immunity hit. Hey, gym junkie, come on. A coconut nut is a nut. You know what's the difference between what? an egg and a beetroot? You can beat an egg, but you can't beat a root. <laughs> yeah? You're cracking yourself up, <laughs> mate? Uh, dad jokes. Dad jokes. No, Bring no. out the rocks, love. I beat it my mommy when I did. You beat your what? I beat it my mommy when I did. Okay, you what? Have no, to you didn't. In mommy's room. What? You did not. I took you to the bathroom. Took you to the candy shop. <laughs> they all start out not wanting to be on the internet and now they're all like, did you shake? Don't want to be on the internet. I don't want to be on the internet. It's not bad. Try it. It's good. Got a little like ginger and carrot. Ginger. Mummy! Mm. Mm. To make a watermelon like strawberry thing that they made me yesterday with nothing in it and charge $9 is ridiculous. Or does the packaging cost a lot? Well, everything costs a lot. Is this your favourite? Look at that beautiful, beautiful water. Is this your favourite? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's like ten boats fishing out there. Are you counting all the fishing boats that you're not on? Yes. Willie is a boating man. This is why my father... A boaty? A boaty? You like to call yourself a sailor? This is why my father approved of him. Because of his sailing side. Uh, um, meow. Don't do, don't wreck. <clears throat> I think he's already wrecked this part. What's going on? Looking <laughs> over limoncello, you know, on my last vlog I showed you the brothers that Will bought the restaurant off. 
the older brother Angelo makes the most amazing limoncello and they actually bottle it and sell it at the restaurant as well I think these no scariness involved but these this is lemon tree that some of Quincy's ashes and some of my father's ashes are sprinkled under no no scariness involved <laughs> if that's your thing but I'm gonna um, pick the ripe ones and give them to Angelo Okay, beautiful. Wow, that is a good amount of lemons. They are yellow, the bag's making them look green. And yes, <laughs> their ashes are underneath it. Sorry if that scares anyone, but look, it's life, right? It's life. Okay, let's go see if we can find Willie and get a blessed bowl. <laughs> Another blessed bowl on the vlog even though we know he loves them. He likes to call it expensive air, <laughs> meaning there is no nourishment in a blessed bowl, acai bowls. He said they're just sugar rubbish. Okay, he's opinionated. Okay, I just got a call from my essay from Amez. No, it's, it's not for a quota bag. It's for a, um, kind of high demand bag ish and um, I just I don't know she told me the combination but I just don't know and I was watching uh, Freya's vlog the other day and I was just like she mentioned this bag and I was like girl I wonder what she thinks of this combination and I was like let's message her on Instagram and see what she thinks I've put a filter on because I look like rubbish hi Freya it's Jerusha how are you going Babe, I just wanted to send you a video message. Uh, I watched I watched your last vlog and you had said you'd gone out in London somewhere to one of the Hermes boutiques. My essay just called me saying that she had from my wish list that I wanted available with silver hardware. So it's got palladium hardware. What do you think? Hey, tell the vlog how much you like Bless Bowl. <laughs> Go on, guys. Prove me right. <laughs> what did she I? She makes me have a frozen thing <laughs> for breakfast in the middle of winter. <laughs> I go, just told her you, you call it whipped air. Acai bowls and sugar bowls. <laughs> I forced him though. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's end this once and for all. Okay, guys. <laughs> o O T D. I think that's what it's called. Oh my god! Every time I look at these pants, they remind me of a butcher. Let's do it then. No, no, let's do it. What I are we doing? Just for you. What are you doing? He calls this a precinct outfit. The precinct used to be five kilometers around the area. <laughs> Last time she took it to 50 k's out of the area. Let's go over it's it. a new come precinct. Here. Let's come here. Yeezys. Who cares? Who cares? This precinct area is worth more than a luxury. Who cares what it's worth? It look depends on what you look like. Look at me. Bogan. Look at me. It's what's called Bogan. quiet luxury at the moment. Bogan. But in a Bogan version. Ready? Yeezys. Adidas. Bogan. Yeezys. Bogan. Saint Laurent. That's okay. Celine. Depends what you wear. That's okay. Vuitton. That's okay. Rolex. That's okay. Cartier. Okay. So, we used to have cash converters in back in the day. You could buy this whole outfit for about $3. Just because it's worth something and it's like 
every item is worth this much. Putting it together, looking like a dag. But that's the thing. There's this new Exactly. So she just rolls out of bed. <laughs> <laughs> rolls out of bed, grabs the handbag and goes, let's go. Let's 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 see point. those pearly yellows. Are they <laughs> Get out of here. Get out of here, Bryce. A follower asked in my Q&A video, um, I, uh, I made a um, question and answers video mm -hmm. of questions on Instagram. Someone asked where we met and how we fell in love. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look, right there. <laughs> right there, let's reenact our love story. Julian, how are you? Your daughter looks homeless and cold. <laughs> Would you like to come in and heat up? Should I have my beanie? Should I have my beanie? <laughs> I was standing there. There you go, right darling. Here. I love you so much. There's your coffee. And I made some bread, so I offered some bread to the homeless person. <laughs> I was she really didn't take it. I was really cold after the accident. For years. Like a year after the accident, I was like 30 kilos in size and I was really cold and it was a really cold night in winter and Will made bread and mum and I stood here and he offered us bread he's taking the piss saying that I was looked homeless which I did I had like a beanie on didn't I yeah the restaurant didn't look like this though dang Let's go scare Andy. Andrew! Well, well, no, don't give my lemons to anyone. I can make some <laughs> Andrew! He doesn't like lemons. How did you pick lemons from my tree? So these are the lemons from my Maya lemon tree at home, which Gillian planted because she had a Maya lemon tree up in the Blue Mountains, remember when they lived there? So how many bottles of and lemon my, did you make? And my dad's and my Very dog's lovely. <laughs> my dad and my dog's ashes are buried under it. So these are for you. Hello, Patrick. <laughs> no, I bought them for you Why to make a limoncello. Why well, like because Angelo green. loves making limoncello, oh, doesn't he? Does. Why did you pick so, them green? No, no, just a little bit turned. No, no. Yes, yes. <laughs> I bought them for Angelo to make limoncello. Well, Angelo's not here today. That's Andrew. No, I'm He's been saying. been with us for 23 years. I'm saying that I'm leaving them here for Angelo. They're my father's lemons. It sounds better if I say it with that kind of accent. So we need engineers. Yeah. Our builders here. Hi guys. Look at the truck. Say hi. This is Dan. Sexy Dan, our builder. Shout out Diamond. Diamond Building Solution. Cowboy. Other than the fact that he builds my houses. Other than the fact he builds my houses, he also lives at Will's Bar. <laughs> in the restaurant. Don't put that up. Why no, not? Seriously, don't put that up. <laughs> You've got someone watching your news on. <laughs> <laughs> Very true. That's true. <laughs> we take care of him. What? It's good. Um, Dan, why are you here, babe? Can you just jack up the boys' cubby house? <laughs> Look at the angle it's on. Got on it. Was Lucy here? <laughs> <laughs> I'm putting that on the vlog. The problem with me, Will, is that you're on the internet permanently, mate. Oh, it's on the here. It's on the We need to put a brace on it. Oofed. No, Dan's got the idea, mate. Wrong way, Willie. Uh, Pull it out. So we just got to put another couple of tools on here. Just needs a little bit of love. 
Yeah, it's got no love, mate. <laughs> Don't worry, once I get the pool, we'll be in the pool. <laughs> totally. <sighs> Don't you want to say hi to my vlog? Good morning. Good morning. Who's on the vlog? Who's, oh, who's on, on the vlog? I'm going to get some hate mail over this I'm going to get so much stuff. This is the new star of the vlog now. Everybody no, wants Willie to do candid. Get me off. Candid. <laughs> Take it out of context. Seriously, is... <laughs> Seriously, all his mates text him now. Going, how's your new handbag? <laughs> how's your new Chanel? Listen, if you hang out with me, you're going on the internet, whether you like it or not. <laughs> That's what's happening these days, people. Fit. We have a tripod. Oh. Jules is waiting for me. Oh God. Okay, okay, get off me ass. I indicated. Jules is waiting for me on the street. We're gonna go to lunch together. This is the ultimate in bougie, okay? The ultimate. Oh my God, oh my gosh, how are you? Ah. Hi, I, tr uh, uh, I tried you last week because um, I was just going to tell you um, if you got really, really sick to not take the antiviral. But I assume you're better now. <laughs> oh, yeah, but also, it's, isn't it really hard to get antivirals? At her you're age, old? it is. At our age, it is, but you can try and get it from your GP or yeah. go to like the clinics and say you're really sick with the virus. Yeah. But and there's what, been, the, there's the been, cra well, there, there's just been crazy side effects and, um, oh, really? yeah, you know, my mum's best friend. Okay. I just got off the phone. That was my best friend. She just had COVID the other week and I wanted to see her next week. So mum kept saying, Mum kept saying she wanted to go and have lunch together. She's been down at my brother's house in Canberra. She wanted to have lunch together and the request was in the sun. Is this sunny enough for you, dog? Say hi, guys. Hi, guys. Just <coughs> had ABC apple, carrot. No. Apple, beetroot, and carrot. I can't, I violet. cannot write this shit. I saw it somewhere. Like you, Say it, it again, one. I cannot write this. It's a really stupid bag. It doesn't stand up. <laughs> it's a heart. Once again, it doesn't fit anything except your wallet. God forbid you need to put something in it, it doesn't fit. <laughs> it's a really stupid bag, she says. It's okay, it only costs $4,000. <laughs> Look at this. Yum. So this is their smashed av at this little cafe. Smashed avocado, two poached eggs. And mum got the veggie burger, which is so, so fresh and delicious. They make the variety themselves. So fresh. You guys are loving that I show you around the northern beaches. So this cafe that we just ate that lunch at is on the surf beach called Narrabeen, which is actually the longest surf beach. Is it? It's the longest surf beach in Sydney, isn't it? Yeah, it is. From headland to headland, it's the longest. We're in the seated area, but I'll see if I can get you other and shots. One at the beach, look. <laughs> yep. This is why they call it the Northern Beaches. Beautiful. Oh, the colour of that water. Is she waiting for you? No, not at 3.30. She <laughs> has gone. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You <laughs> stood her up, mate. You stood your friend up. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I just oh, wanted shit. to show you guys. Oh, my God. I can't believe that, Annie. I'm so sorry. Well, Julia's just... <laughs> Oh shit, oh shit. I'm so sorry, sorry Annie. Annie. Oh my god, I completely and absolutely forgot. Because I did not go to croquet this morning. I didn't feel up to it. Got back from Canberra late yesterday, but I just, I'm so, so sorry. Are you dictating that? Yeah. 
You can't dictate that fast, baby. It's yes, a voice message. Does it very well. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> Sorry, Annie. Oh my god, I completely I said oh I actually god. forgot. While Gillian's writing her text message to her friend who she stood up. I didn't feel up to it. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to show you guys. On the other vlog, <laughs> I got a facial with my friend so, Katie. So At the end of that facial, I'm walking out of her house and we're both having a laugh about how I bought my own water. That wasn't water, it was sparkling, like, can't believe sparkling I water and I lime. Just feel terrible. I'm so, so sorry. So, lime and soda in this glass. This is. I'm so, so sorry, lime and soda in this glass. <laughs> in this glass and um yeah i had it in here with me this is true bougie and i'm not gonna lie this is coca-cola this is the same glass from our pantry i will not compromise with drinking carbonated <laughs> drinks i have to drink them in glass i so i'll if i have if i have it if i pick up a coke from the you know petrol station I'll drink it out of the can that's not what I'm saying but I'll buy it out of a glass bottle if I can oh, or I'll just... pour it from home in a glass so, so, and bring it in my car that's what I do yeah now in life I'm not gonna waste the calories and all the sugar if I'm not gonna drink it out of glass right Jills you know that everybody calls you Jills on the vlog I say how's Jills so sorry, I feel terrible. She's the one that had me to lunch there. Poor Annie. You ditched her. I ditched her. Oh, Jesus. I forgot completely. Shit, she's never going to have lunch with you again. I had to go tomorrow to there because of going to the... Well, you're uninvited for life. <laughs> I'm in trouble. <laughs> he said they're midgets. <laughs> Gotta get this stool in the show a photo, Baba. Move, baby, move. <laughs> you know those big people that are riding those little ponies? <laughs> like this, like this, like this. Stop. See how you're being mm -hmm. stupid? Have you had your breakfast? Yet? Maybe not. <laughs> Well, that's then a return. And then look at these, do I see? Right. Yeah, you? look at all these. How these are I suburbs. Oh, bubble wrap! Oh my bubble god. Wrap. All right, mashed potato. Sister. Did you become a chef? I'm thinking like, should I, should I? Were you? You think you could become a chef? People deserve to eat this. This is him in his natural habitat. Everybody can see him with his oven. Why don't you do a quick overview yeah, of your oven? Not overview, but just tell them what it is. It's an oven. Oh. They want a tour of his house as well. Cryo Bucky. I want a tour of your house as well. Do a chef move. That's a chef move. Come on. Do it so the camera can see. <gasps> and just like that. Bon appetit. I, I slaved away. <laughs> Once again. <laughs> Once again. I slaved away over a hot stove to bring you this gourmet meal. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't see that. Yeah, they did. <laughs> He's making fun of my horsey riding chair, guys. It went back today. 
We just have to search something else. I found a lot of things on Temple and Webster. Mm -hmm. Taste it, chef. How is my amazing cooking? No? Yes? What do you do? He doesn't have them plugged into anything. But this is so my baby. Huh? <laughs> Zaki! Look at me! Zaki! Baba! Look at me! You got that, that I can't start it looking But you got that, huh, yeah I need you so much I can't get started to call you, baby, so much, huh, yeah And I don't know why you are like that And I don't know why you treat me badly And I don't know why you are like that And I don't know why you treat me badly My friend Steph, I've shown you Stephanie She stayed at our house while we were away in Fiji she said, is there been a delivery to the house? And I said, no, but there has been. Oh, Steffi got us a delivery of flowers, Will. Sorry? Baby, yes, Steph delivered us flowers. I want to say thank you for letting me stay. Oh my God, babe. She can stay anytime you like. So I also were out here in a lovely scenic environment. Of course, I am online shopping. <sighs> Smell the fresh air and add to cart. However, I have fallen into a bit of a trap and it's it's not a good one. And I, I guess I'll explain why and just why I guess a lot of girls, it's a difficult kind of topic, okay? I feel like when you guys watch videos and you see, you know, Chanel after Chanel after Hermes after Louis Vuitton, these are such strong staple brands that if there is a change in mind, they will resell. They just will resell. You'll be able to move it on and at a good price, not at a massive loss. There are other houses that are really high purchase prices and you will lose a lot in your resale if you want to get rid of it. Really, a lot. And the best one for that is Mr. Christian Dior, unfortunately. And the worst part is, is that their sale price new from the boutique is so high. Yes, it is an amazing brand. And yes, they have the right, sorry. Yes, they have the right to be, you know, so high. It is the most amazing materials and it, it is to top artisans making their bags and their products and their items however unfortunately that doesn't mean it resells good, well at all it's actually quite a loss in that house and there's many different houses that do have a large loss and I would be happy to talk about that in a video if you want me to um, it's not talked about a lot and it's not said because obviously you see all of the unboxings of these other huge high-end luxury conglomerates that will resell perfectly and plus plus so you're always going to make money on a Hermes bag because of the rarity of it um so on and so forth it's a whole you know another video but we can go into that it's not a problem however i've been bitten by the dior bug again i have once i did get asked i got so many questions in that like ask me q a question thing that I did on Instagram and then I did film a Q&A off it last week so and one of the questions was have you owned a Dior bag I have I have I've owned two and that's how I know that the resale is not good because I moved them on and lost a lot of money and they were pretty much brand new I barely used them um, but I'm bitten again I just love the oblique. I love all the Dior Riviera line. I think it's so beautiful. But I might start with 
not even accessories, I might start with home goods. I think I'm gonna buy a new coffee mug from them as well. Update on the coffee mugs. Um, I went to put through my order, which you saw in the last vlog online. And then when I was actually speaking to my essay, she was like, the online stock isn't in for a couple of weeks. I am going to see her next week. Ah, I just got an appointment. I got a call from her saying a leather appointment call. Um, saying to come in and look at a bag that I asked about and we're going to go in next week and I'm going to take you with me of course hopefully I can film I don't know what their kind of restrictions are with filming but the boss just asked where I'm going where are you going where are you going why do you have shoes on and pants and you don't look like a bogan <laughs> Next level brutal. So many people say it's so cool how we're like best friends. Are we? <laughs> I said to him the other day, good, right? I said to him the other day, just pretend I die in the car accident. Just pretend I end up in a wheelchair. He goes, if you did, I'd push you down the driveway. <laughs> <laughs> I'll push you down. A hill that there's water around us. <laughs> I am, I am pulling the vlog on to my friends. You haven't done anything. Oh, okay. I'm pulling the vlog on to show you her baby. Where are you? Oh, there you are. <laughs> What's that? You got a stamp. Why don't get Nanny Lucy to pick you up? Look what she does. This is what she does. She allows my sister-in-law to put his hair back in a pony. Ah, oh, no, no. And then Luce feeds him as much baby Chino as he wants. Look at me. Come on. Good. No, look at me. Don't destroy my restaurant. Oh. I got in trouble. I got in trouble from the other vlog. Family. You're not allowed to say mine. Oh. And on the other vlog, I said to the boys, I don't know, I said to George's football team, oh, this is my restaurant. Oh. <laughs> and I copped crap. Sorry, correction. Our restaurant. Our restaurant. Will's restaurant. And his brothers and his father. And then he said, I said, what it's am I meant actually. to say? What am I meant to say? And Will goes, just say it's Mussy and Zachy. No, it's mine. <laughs> it's Lucy's. Mine? That better be apple juice. Are you feeding my son beer? Can you get a No, song? that's fine. More, please. Jasmine hates his fringe, so she puts it up. How was your meeting, boss? I'm sweating. I sent um, the girls the pictures of you from 2007. They said you're old. Well, when his hair was actually dark. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's rude. That's so rude. What? Don't worry, I got him on the what vlog. Great. I got him on the vlog doing oh, gut. Okay, great. I got him on the vlog doing gardening, and his chest hair is grey. Yes, it happens. Uh huh. Silverback. <laughs> okay, who wants to know? Fun, fun. We are now on my Sony Alpha. That's correct because my G7X is dead. It's over. I can't believe it. It's dead. Hopefully this is working. I have not vlogged on my Alpha for a little while. I think that I probably do need an external mic of some sort. I'm not quite sure. I am going to try and vlog on this for the rest of this vlog. Uh, because I wanted to trade out my bag. I wanted to do a quick Pandora unboxing with you. I know, Pandora. <sighs> Mum thinks I'm a little girl. I know a lot of you collect Pandora out there. Let me know what you think. Mum thinks it's for little girls. I think she sold Pandora's house. Isn't that so cool? Um, the owner of Pandora, she sold her house. A gorgeous house over in, uh, I think it was in Vaucluse in Sydney. Anyway, and um, she just thinks it's for kids. So she laughed her head off at me. She was like, you have bought Pandora? She has her new gold collection. So I was like, 
I really wanted the Tiffany Return to Tiffany in gold. It's like $8,000. And I know I'll get sick of it. I, I wanted it. I used to have it in sterling silver. So does mum. But I know I'll get annoyed by it, I'm sure. So I just kind of looked into Pandora. Let me know what you think below. Okie dokie. We are going to end this vlog here. I am going to do a... This is where I like to keep all my hauls that I haven't shown you guys. But let's do a Pandora unboxing together. Because I want to try this out. And I want to do it with you guys to see what you think. Okay. Let's do this. Pandora. Cute. Comes with a little... Oh, the Pandora Me Club. Alright, alright, alright. This is what I wanted to show Mussy. Oh, that's right. She gave me this. This is what I wanted to show Mussy. If anything, I just want to collect the marble. This is the one I really want to get. I showed it to Mussy. The Marvel Avengers. The gauntlet. <laughs> the gauntlet glove bangle. Uh, um, the gauntlet glove charm. He would love that. That is so cool. So, obviously Pandora is known for its silver collections. But, coming out with gold, I think, is what I just was kind of like. Whether it's plated or... I know that they do have, I think, 14 carat solid gold. I'll have to work it out and find out and tell you. But that's the new... Here is my authenticity and my receipt. Um, which is gorgeous. I mean, I know there's so many Pandora collectors out there. It's beautiful. Beautiful packaging. A bit of tissue paper. The zhuzh. Very nice. Congratulations on your Pandora. <laughs> My first Pandora. Beautiful. So let's take a look. This is our little draw box. Look, it's really gorgeous. It makes for beautiful little presents. I think that's why mum makes fun of it because, like, you give them as little presents. <laughs> but cute, right? So cute. Ta da! And here we have. Our Pandora. Oh, yeah, come around. Yeah, this is a bit easier because I'm behind the camera and there's nice light. Here we have our Pandora bracelet. So this isn't like the regular charm charm bracelets, I think. This is the new, or not new, but this is a style that's adjustable. Um, it's got the adjustable bauble and I loved that when she showed it to me I was like she's like oh this is here but you know we can get the um, the uh, this is like a different um, collection but we can get the original for you I was like no 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 I love this I love the idea of being able to slide the ball chain up and down I think that's so cool and she was like oh you do and I was like yeah it's beautiful so I really loved that idea um, so I forgot how she said you do it. It's a beautiful mechanism. I think you just pull it. It's got Pandora engraved around it. If you can see that. It's got Pandora on the bauble. And you have the two baubles at the end. You have the Pandora around the the stoppers. And then you have this beautiful like snake, snake chain. Which is what they're known for. Their classic like you put the charms on that. So let's do this. I think you just pull it right. Oh yeah, it just slides. Oh, it's so beautiful. That's actually really beautiful. All right. <laughs> and I think, let's look at the guarantee, but I think it's 14 karat gold plated. But this is called the Shine Moments Sliding Bracelet. Okay. The Shine Moments Sliding Bracelet. I love this mechanism. It's so pretty. Okay, so let's put it next to my Jusson Clue and my Love. I wanted it for inside like so. How do you do this on your own? I guess you kind of slide the ball. 
with your hand. <laughs> Struggle. Sorry if this is painful to watch, but... Oh, okay. Oh, cute! Oh, very cute! Oh, I like it hanging down like that. So, doing it up a little bit less than all the way. Now, she said that they start out really stiff. But then as people either collect charms or over time it softens, the actual um, rope chain softens. I thought that was really cool. Hello, Pandora. Come through. Oh, I like that noise already. See, I wanted a charm bracelet. I wanted the Tiffany return to Tiffany love heart in the solid gold, but... I knew it would just probably annoy me after a while, and the thing is like $9,000. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's quite cute. I would like to get charms for it. I would like to get the marble charms just because Mussy and Zaki would love that. But isn't that a cool mechanism? Honestly, that is so cool how that slides up and down. Let's go see how this goes. I forgot how you... Oh god, I'm forgetting everything, but I think you unlock the side to put the charms on. Let's get some charms and then we'll do that together, okay? We'll do all this stuff together. But I hope you're loving these vlogs, guys. I will see you in my next one. Take care. Peace.